Hello YouTube, um, it's been a very long time since I made my last video but um, well I've been really really busy in the last month, I'm still um, but today I decided to take a little break in a beautiful sunny day here in Barcelona, it's really warm it's over 24-25 degrees centigrade and it's really nice, so I decided to take a break smoking my Ardor Fatuelli full band pipe. It is a black rusticated pipe, it's a really really nice pipe, heavy pipe, large wall. And um, well as I said before, um, I got a plenty of job in my bureau, in my office, and moreover I'm studying now, I may taking a postgraduate course on uh, energy efficiency and sustainability in architecture. I'm taking German car, uh, German course uh, for improving my, my German and um, well, I'm making a lot of stuff, uh, probably too much, but anyway I am also having fun. Uh, things are going more or less well, although the heavy crisis we are suffering here in Spain. Mm. But anyway, it feels good. Um, I wanted to make this video in order to say that I keep on following on you guys on the YouTube channel. There's always new people and and. And the old ones keep on with the good videos, good presentations, it makes really fun. Although I don't have time to make videos, but it makes really fun to follow you. Um, I wanted also to say that uh, it would be nice to be in the second annual Pipe Conference, uh, YouTubers uh, Pipe Conference, um, that it will take place in, in Marietta, uh, Georgia. Um, I think Anthony is making a great job organizing everything and I think you are all going to have really fun there. It's going to be, it will be great, great to be there. I hope you are making a lot of videos and showing us uh, how it's been going on. Um, and well, the other reason I wanted to make this video is because um, I got a couple of pipes that um, I want I've been considering since a long time to selling them not because they are bad smokers, not because they are bad quality pipes, not at all but just because I'm, uh, well, I feel like more interested in other shapes and other size pipes, I don't know um, they're really good smokers but, well, I just want to try new pipes I've not been purchasing very new pipes in the last months uh, I'm pretty much more interested now in tobaccos and uh, as I was considering this, uh, before selling these pipes on eBay, uh, and as I am really interested, in, much more interested now in tobacco than in pipes, in purchasing pipes, um, an idea came to my mind. Instead of uh, selling these pipes on eBay, in eBay uh, why don't you uh, offer a trade in the YouTube? Uh, in which your trade, I trade my pipes for pipe tobacco. Um, um, I think it could be a good idea, as maybe someone is interested in having new pipes and they, uh, you know, they are not in the same period as me, and they are more interested in tobacco than in pipes. But maybe there is someone else that is looking for pipes and and not paying a lot for them and. and and maybe at this kind of exchange, this kind of trade could be interesting. That's an idea came to my mind. So I want to show you the pipes that I wanted to sell. Um, if someone of you is interested in any of these pipes or in both of them, just send me a personal message, and then we can discuss about the, the, the how. Okay, for this pipe how much how many tobacco do you want for i won't be asking for many tobacco it's just a question of instead of selling it just to to making a trade and and okay 
I think it make it makes it a little bit more personal, not like putting putting for sale on the eBay and then okay, I don't know you. It's a little bit anonymous, and I think it could be much more interesting in that way. So I'm gonna show you the pipes, and then if someone is interested, just send me a personal um, message, and we can talk about it. Okay, the first one is a very well-known uh, brand uh, pipe. I it's a Bjarne pipe. Uh, I purchased this pipe about one year ago, something like that, uh, through the eBay. I try to make a good clean on it, although I don't have a professional machines and everything. But I think it really looks nice right now. And okay, show it to you. This is a pipe. This is a I don't know, Bentec pipe. I don't know something. I don't know exactly how to describe the shapes. Um, here in this side, it has a nice straight grain. Uh, not in this one, here are some spots on the tie. Uh, you, here you can see the logo of Bjarne, right there. Uh, the pipe smokes really good, it smokes, it smokes perfect, I mean I didn't have any problem with it, with this one, neither with the other one, I mean I just want to sell them because I want to try for new shapes and new pipes and, and I'm really much more interested now in tobacco than in pipes and so okay, um, I prefer to discard the capital pies that I know I'm smoking that often and giving chance to tobaccos. And well, uh, I gotta say that it's a medium sized pipe, it's a standard size pipe, it smokes really good, it's a light pipe. Um, um, there's no, some few minimal teeth marks, but not quite remarkable. I mean, it's in pretty good state of conservation. I mean, and um, well, as I said, light pipe, good smoker, very good smoker, it's a Danish pipe. I think it's a, it's a nice piece. The grain here on this side is really wonderful. I really like it. Yep. And that was the first pipe to be honest. And the second one, it's, uh, as you know, I live in Barcelona, Spain. And there are not many pipe, pipe makers in Spain. Uh, but in Catalonia, um, that is the, the area where I want, where I live, we have one which is pretty famous, and he makes some nice pipes. Uh, his pipes are called Sigmund pipes, Sigmund pipes, and um, I could purchase this pipe about also a couple uh, a year ago. It's an estate pipe, but it's really nice. It's a Canadian shape. Look at it. Look at that beauty. It has a black rustication all around. Look at the rust the rustication is just wonderful. It's just wonderful. Wonderful rustication. Here is the signature Sigma pipes. It has a silver ring and it complements perfectly with this beautiful amber colored stem, acrylic stem. It's a nice, it's a really, really nice pipe. Good smoker as well. This is the logo from from the pipe makers. Use this a little, little pipe. It's really nice. And as I said, also very light pipe. Very, very good smoker. It's also rusticated here on the top. No teeth marks here. You won't find any teeth marks. It's perfect state of conservation, good smoker, light pipe. And it's a cedar because as you can see, this side is flat and if you put it right there, it's like, it's not perfect, but uh, it can stand in your, in your table perfectly. So this is the pipe, the Sigmund pipe. And well, um, that's all. In case you are interested in making a tripe, I'm making a try, uh, sorry, pipes for tobacco, uh, then just send me a personal message and we can discuss about tobacco, depends on where do you live, which are your local tobacconists, uh, because I would like to, I'm looking for some specific tobaccos, not the, the McBarrens and all those blends that can be easily found here, at, at least here in Europe. There are Plenty of tobacco in the United States that is not that easy to 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 purchase and um, 
but also in Europe. So in case you're interested, just send me a personal message, it would be nice. Um, and well, um, I hope that my next video doesn't take too long, or at least not uh, as long as it, it took this one to arrive, but as I said, I'm really busy, so I guess it's going to be a little bit difficult, but anyway, um, cheers everyone, and God bless you, till next time, bye bye.